Okay, team, um, this is a setup of what we're going to be doing defensively for tomorrow. Um, against the Vikings, what we're going to do is you play a basic horseshoe defense, all right? And that's what we've been playing since we've, I guess, for the last two games um, since we played the Vikings. Basically, we're trying to keep everything underneath, all right? give them a short field to play in. We're going to put them in a phone booth, make them play in the phone booth, okay? So if we have this set up, all right, with the rusher, you're always going to go and deal with the QB, all right? Cornerback, you're going to be focused in on this running back here. Middle linebacker, you're going to keep an eye out on this guy. Safety, you're going to be playing, looking for where he's going to go. And cornerback over here, you've got that wide receiver, okay? All right, so now, in a scenario in which the Vikings want to uh, cross us up, supposedly, all right? So they say they want to go and run this guy this way, run this guy that way. So in this scenario here, I will deal with it. So if they go, if he goes this way, or if he goes this way you guys just basically stay home and wait for this guy to get here and wait for this guy to get there in the meantime safeties safety you'll still be focused in on that center middle linebacker you're going to be looking uh and in this scenario you're going to be focused in on wherever this running back goes all right but the focal point is if this rusher, if our rusher can get to the quarterback, it's going to shorten the game, it's going to shorten the field up. So now all you guys be on the lookout for the ball coming short, all right? So it's going to cause confusion. And also, too, here's what we can do tomorrow, and we'll probably start working on this now. You guys right here are going to be seven yards out. All right, the rusher will always go across this line of scrimmage to the QB. But here's what we're going to do, too. If you have this, you can have, you know who you're going to have. So let's just say middle linebacker in this situation. In this situation, you're back, and you're going to be rushing towards this running back. So in other words, when you're, you're already going to get a jump, when he rushes, you're going to rush. Safety, you're going to rush up as well to the center without going across the line of scrimmage. He'll go across the line of scrimmage to the QB, but now you're going to be on this guy. Safety, you'll have this guy. So if he wants to throw it short, you should be able to be there to go and pick that pass off. All right? But it's going to be uh, contingent upon what what kind of pressure the rusher, our rusher can do on this QB. All right? And then over here in these two guys, you two guys on the edge, you'll be dealing with these two. All right? Um, if they're not crossing up, if they're crossing up, you got to kind of stay home to look for whoever's going to come across. But then now in that scenario, if they're going to cross up, all right, so you got this guy coming. Now, if he's going to try to throw it out, the rusher's already gone, right? The rusher's already gone. Now, the middle linebacker, you can go and jump this route. You could probably jump this route right here and take it back in, all right? If he wants to cross. If he wants to cross safety, you could jump this route and take it, take it in. You understand? So, there's a few things you can do, but also just remember you can rush up to the line of scrimmage waiting for him all right so there's stunt plays we can run stunt rushes we can run because they're not going to be expecting three guys to be coming but the thing is one guy is coming to the quarterback the other two guys are going to a man okay and then these two guys here will just deal with these guys so it'll be a man coverage basically but it looks like a zone It'll set up like a zone, but it'll be a man coverage type defense. Everybody got it? So, guys, you've been playing outstanding defensively. We haven't really given up much of anything lately.
So let's go and put them in a the phone booth. It's basically horseshoe defense, horseshoe defense. Uh, we want to keep things kind of close. They can, of course, go deep if we're slipping back there. But I want you guys to be on the lookout. Safety, you always got to be mindful of who's back this way. But a lot of it's going to be contingent upon the rusher getting to the quarterback, putting the court pressure on the quarterback to force him to throw something short because the pressure normally, what's going to happen, they're going to try to throw short. So you guys got to be playing, be ready for the ball up in this area somewhere. Okay? So that's pretty much the game plan. Rusher, do what you can. Get that get that quarterback's flag. Get a, get yourself a sack. You're going to help the, help the uh, defense out tremendously. Make things a whole lot easier for us. And um, let's go and just try to keep this team to no points. And at best, at worst, no more than six. But let's try not to give them anything, okay? Well, that's the game plan. Let's let's lock them up. And I know you guys can because you're you're the best team out there. It's time to show it one more time. Until and then next next stop the playoffs. All right. Thanks, guys.